Virtual Play is a reimagining of Samuel Beckett's theatrical text entitled Play for Digital Culture. Play was chosen because it specifically engages the question of dialogue and interactivity. The sequence of the actors speaking is determined by a moving spotlight, which Beckett calls the interrogator. They speak when the light is on them and fall silent when the light is off. Do my best, all I can. Plain of said, have I been neglecting you? How could we be together in the way we are if there was someone else? Loving her as I did with all my heart, I could not but feel sorry for her. She was... I said to him, give her up. I said to him, give her up. I swore by all I held most sacred. Not convinced. I might have known. I smell her off you, she kept saying. There was no answer to this. So I... One morning as I was sitting... So play is a game of interaction between the light operator and the actor, mediated by light technology. In our VR version, we acknowledge the role of the user as active. We recognize new opportunities for narrative and give the power of activation over to the end user, whose gaze becomes the spotlight. The user thus embodies the interrogator and is empowered to independently discover the story merely by looking at the characters. I must have looked incredulous. Ask Erskine, she said, if you don't believe me. But she threatened us to take her own, I said. Not yours, she said. No, I said hers. We had fun trying to work this out. The user also has six degrees of freedom to move around the virtual environment, so the experience is one of active immersion as opposed to passive observation. She was not convinced. I might have known. I smell her off you, she kept saying. There was no answer to this. So I took her in my arms and swore I could not live without her. I meant it others more. Yes, I'm sure I did. She did not repulse me. She put a blood hand on me, but I had a little chat with him. He was glad of the extra money. Virtual play questions the essence of the performance spectacle in digital culture. The project aims to investigate how narrative, perception, communication, and embodiment have been altered through contemporary media and asks how they might operate in the future. I smell you from she screamed. He stinks a bitch. Fearing she was about to offer me violence, I rang for Erskine and had her shown up. Her parting words as he could testify, if he's still living, has not forgotten, coming and going on the earth. 